Hi guys! Welcome back to my channel. So for today's video, we will be doing an unboxing and review of a Dream H11 Wet and Dry Vacuum Cleaner. It has a double box but it was delivered so it's super secure. So first, we have the user manual. Then there's the cleaning brush and brush holder. We also got the charger and an extra filter. It also comes with a free detergent floor cleaner and this one here is the vacuum handle. So for our main event, yep, a little bit heavy. So this is our main body with floor brush. So the floor brush is um, already attached to the main body. Yes. So pretty! And last but not the least, it also comes with a charging base for convenience. So this is where you could um, auto-clean or self-clean and then charge. Now we're attaching the handle onto the vacuum cleaner. Yes! Looks so pretty. So here's our vacuum cleaner already on the dock and charging. This one here is the self-cleaning button, then the turbo mode button, and then the power button. Then this one is the display which shows the percentage as well as some notifications. So right now we are already on the dock. And in here is the dirty water tank and this one is the clean water tank where we usually put water and some cleaning detergent. See? So let's try to put the clean water tank on the main unit. There you go. Just make sure you slide it in at an angle so that you would be able to easily push the clean water tank. Now, let's try it. So right now, this is the standard mode with the clean water tank um, safely installed. So if you notice, it's really easy to clean the floor this way. For not so dirty floors, the standard mode is just enough. So it cleans already the floor and mops it at the same time. So that is why I really love this vacuum cleaner. Because it doesn't just, you know, vacuums off the dirt, but it also sweep, uh, mops the floor at the same time. Making it a lot easier for me to clean, especially since I'm a working mom. Making sure that I have the right tools that will make my life easier is really a priority for me. So during my initial testing of this vacuum cleaner, I noticed something. So whether I'm on standard mode or turbo mode, I noticed that it leaves the floor a little bit more wet than I prefer. I have two kits. One of them is toddler. So it's really important for me to have dry, clean floors. I cannot allow our floor to stay wet for a longer period of time because you know accidents could happen especially if I have running toddler in the house so what I did is I reached out Dream's customer service through their IG account 
I showed them some pictures and videos of my vacuum cleaner in action. Honestly, it really it's not really that wet, like it will leave a super puddle, but it will really take some time before it dries up. So probably around a minute or so. But still it's not acceptable for me. So what they advised me is that I could remove the clean water tank so that I won't have excess water during vacuuming and mopping the floor. Honestly, this vacuum is really perfect for me because aside from it being able to vacuum and mop my floor at the same time, making it a lot easier and faster for me to clean my house, it also does self-cleaning um, and auto-charging once I put it back on the dock. It's really very, very convenient. Previously, I used to have um, a spray mop from Dierma, but my problem there is I have to always wash the actual mop or the actual cloth that I use. In here, um, you could see that I am using my vacuum cleaner without the clean water tank. It still leaves some wetness on the floor, but it really dries up quickly. Also, I would usually just ensure that I clean the brush before and after vacuuming. So it's really very, very easy. Overall, I am extremely satisfied with this vacuum cleaner. It's not cheap. It's a little bit pricey at least for me but with the convenience that it gives me and the easiness and cleaning that it allows me I think it's really worth it. I got this vacuum cleaner from Shopee and I'll leave the link on the description box below. So if you like this video, please don't forget to give us a thumbs up and subscribe to our channel for more uh, videos such as this one. Bye!